on that Providence demonstration transpiring in the wake of the death of Baltimore man Freddie Gray. Providence police tell us that display went smoothly, with Colonel Hugh Clements commending participants for exercising their constitutional rights in an orderly manner. They marched peacefully from classical high school to public safety and wrapped up at DARE, the home of direct action rights and equality. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lands was covering the demonstration all afternoon. She joins us now from the capital city with more tonight. Shante. And Jared, that's right, some 400 protesters marched from Classical High School and gathered here outside of Providence Police Headquarters. This is part of a nationwide movement after the homicide in Baltimore of Freddie Gray. Hundreds of protesters march in downtown Providence in solidarity. We want to see justice happen from this movement. Their walk echoed across the nation Saturday, coinciding with Baltimore's calling for justice in the now homicide of a black man, 25 year old Freddie Gray. Six Baltimore police officers have been charged, one of the charges, second degree murder. This has been going on for quite a while, and it's unfortunate that it took to this point for something to else have happened. Justice. Do you think this this movement, this nationwide movement, will bring change everywhere? Yes, I do, because this is what the country needs right now. This is about the fundamental relationship that communities of color have with their police departments. There are certainly issues around the country, and we're not perfect, but I would say overall our relationships are pretty good. In fact, I'd say they're very good. Police accountability is important. Police professionalism is important, and black lives do matter. Why did you make this sign? Um, I made it because so people can know that it's happening like for no reason and so they know what it means to be have equal rights. Do you say that it might even be a social class issue as well? You know, everything in America is a race issue and embedded in that means class, means economics, means everything else that comes along with that. So it, it is both. And Providence police tell me that there have been zero arrests and zero incidents. The chief says that's exactly what he hoped for. He even commended protesters for keeping their march peaceful. Reporting with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.